In this video, I will demonstrate how to automate a use case scenario with Zapdest. In this example, the use case describes the login process to the Zapdest website. I will be using the use case to create mockups, scan the mockups to collect test objects, build a test, and run it against a live application. Any GUI prototyping tool can be used to draw a mockup. For the home page mockup, I just need the Zaptest logo text and login link. Next, I will scan the mockup with Zaptest, define the application and the view objects. On the home page view, I only need to keep two objects for Zaptest logo and login link. Next, I will draw another mockup for a login page. Here, I need to include two text boxes for the username and password and the login button. Now I can scan the second mockup. I'm selecting existing application object, Zap, and adding a new view, Login. On this view, I only need to keep objects required to enter the username and password values. I can delete all the others. Next, I will draw the third mockup for the user zone page. This page must display the welcome greeting with the user's name. During the test, I will log in with Tester1 user account. Now I can scan the third mockup. I'm selecting the existing application object, Zap, and adding a new view, User Zone. On this view, I only need to keep the object with the welcome greeting. Next, I will be using the test objects to define the test steps. Once the test is ready, I will press the Run button to execute it against a live application. When the test run is complete, I will open the test result to verify a successful execution. This same test can be used to auto-generate test documentation and also be used for parallel execution across multiple devices using multi-run. For more information, please visit our website at www.zaptest.com.